All right, so you've got your email and you're using the web browser and now you want to actually set up one of your applications on your computer to collect your email so you can work offline. That's the main reason. A lot of people I talk to just tell me they're quite happy just going to a web browser, but when you're on an airplane or you're traveling or you can't get Wi-Fi, you can't access your emails, which is a bit hopeless. So let me show you how to go about setting up email on mail on a Mac for a start. So I'm gonna flip into um, mode. First of all, if you don't know what mail is, do a search by holding the command key down, hitting the space bar, typing in the word mail, and you'll find that you already have a mail application on your phone. Once that opens, you wanna to go to the top left-hand side, click on mail, and then click on preferences. And voila, a box will pop up like you see here. Now, when I, set up my Gmail, because uh, I use Google Calendar on my computer, it also noticed that Google had a mailbox, and that's why I can see it in my list right in front of me. Okay, without confusing you too much, it says, um, do I want to activate this uh, email? There's a button here that says enable email. And um, that's it. It's all you need to do. So in a few minutes, you'll see that uh, all my email folders that are on my professional email service have turned up under under Google. And also in my inbox, um, I've currently only got one email um, in my inbox. So I keep a pretty lean inbox. It's something I currently thoroughly recommend that you do the same. Now I'm going to go through it and just add another one. So I'm going to go back to preferences and I have a um, an option here to actually connect my Apple email, which is dehek at me.com. Once again, I click that account and, um, and now voila, you'll see on the left-hand side here, you've got email and uh, Gmail. And obviously you can actually rename those to whatever name you want by going back to preferences. And instead of calling it uh, iCloud, you could call it Apple. Apple W, and then here you could actually just, if you really wanted to, you could just call it your name or your email address. And when you shut that down, now on the right hand side, you've got all my emails coming through. But I don't like um, Apple Mail. A lot of people are using Outlook. Uh, I don't like Outlook either. And I use a email program called Earmail which has won some awards for handling its email, and I have many different hats. So in my next video, I'm gonna show you how I go about setting up email and how I manage that. I'll see you in the next video.